Welcome to Office Experts tutorial video on Sales Module Part 1. This video explains how to enter sales information, type of sale, quotation, order, or invoice, and the details of the item or services sold. The video also explains how to record customer payments, issue a customer credit and how to analyze a sales activities with reports. Overview Sales is a portion of order management module. The order management module is integrated with accounting, contact management, and inventory management to ensure fulfillment of every sales order and improves visibility of sales transactions. Office Expert fast track your sales by eliminating manual process and establishing a smooth flow from sales quote to sales invoice. The solution offers features which enable users to convert type of sales such as sales quote to sales order or sales invoice to delivery order. This will eliminate manual bottlenecks and improve the sales process by reducing errors. In Office Expert, a posted invoice is a source document while a delivery order is treated as an attachment slash complement to the source document. Therefore a delivery order may not be created without an invoice. The invoice will generate a journal and update inventory values. Sales Document Type Sales quotation record an estimated price and allows a prospective buyer to see the costs that would be involved for the work or goods they are buying. It has no impact on your inventory and can be changed to an order or an invoice when your customer is ready to buy. Sales order An order is a sale where no services or goods have been delivered. Although it is an acknowledgement of a sale, no movement on your inventory will take place and can be changed to an invoice when your customer is ready to buy. Sales invoice An invoice is usually created upon confirmation from customer and lists the description of goods and services ordered. It can be defined as the request of payment from the customer for goods sold or services provided by the seller. Delivery order A document from supplier which indicate the goods has been delivered to customer and received in good condition. Credit note A document given to offset or increase the company account payable or account receivables. Cash sales A document issue for cash sales. Sales process flow. One click sales tab menu. On this page, the system provides sales flowchart. Three icons on the left side are shortcuts for sales listing, sales ledger, and sales summary. To choose the type of sales document, quotation, order, or invoice. Three enter information about the document. Complete the fields as described in the following video. A customer. Select customer from the drop down list. The customer has been created when users added contacts during setup at video 2, company setup titled create a contact. B date. Enter the invoice date. C invoice no. This will be auto generated by the system. D shipping date. Enter the goods delivery date. E transaction. Currency the transaction currency has been set when the customer created. F department. Users can choose to select the department that issued this document, optional. G project. Users can select project that is related to this document. H salesperson. Users able to select the salesperson in charge of the sale. I billing address. This section is automated by the system as created by users. J shipping address. This section is automated by the system as created by users. 4. Enter the transaction's information. The following illustration will guide fields that users are required to fill. A. Add item. This button will allow users to check the items available and its quantity. B. Add services. This button will allow users to check the services offered by the company to its customer. C. Miscellaneous entry. Users able to choose revenue account. D. Code. Item code preset during item setup, showed in video 2, company setup titled add an item slash inventory. E description. A description of the item appeared automatically as preset during item setup. The description can be amend. F quantity. The quantity to be delivered. G unit. Unit was preset during item setup. H cost. Cost will appear automatically based on the average purchase price of the item. I price. 
the price of the item appeared automatically based on the sale price that has been set up. J amount. Calculated automatically by the system. K discount optional. Type a volume discount as an amount. L tax. The default tax for an item appears automatically. The tax code can be amended accordingly. 5. The following video explain the additional information in the document such as transaction options, remarks, and invoice amount. A. Tax inclusive. When you tick this command, the system will calculate the tax into the total. B. Payment terms. The conditions under which a seller will complete a sale. These terms specify the period allowed to a buyer to pay off the amount due. C. Remarks user can write remarks that related to this document. D. Invoice amount. Total amount for this transaction. 6. When the document is saved or posted, users will be directed to the listing page. The following video explain the details available on the listing page. A. Filter. Search filter to narrow the list. B. Date. The date of the document. C. Number. Automated numbering system to avoid number duplication. Each document will receive its own unique number. D. Customer slash payer. The contact of which the document is issued to. E. Status. The status of the document, new, open, paid, partial paid, cash sales or closed. F. Amount due. Amount due by the contact. G. View. View the document. User can enter this page to email or print the document. H. Alter. Allow users to edit the document. I. Payment. When the icon payment appear, it indicate that the invoice has amount due from customer. Click on the icon will direct user to the receive payment page. J. Reversal. The icon will only appear when the payment has been paid. Click on the icon will direct user to credit note page. Cash sales. One cash sales feature can be treated as point of sales, POS, documentation. No receipt will be generated as the invoice will be treated as the receipt itself. No account payable will be involved in this transaction. Two click sales tab menu and choose cash sales icon. Three steps as shown in sales process flow. Four select the cash account before posting the document. Five on sales listing page. The status of this invoice will always be paid. Issue Receipt One receipt is issued when company receive payment for invoices from customer slash payee. Two click sales tab menu and choose issue receipt icon. Three choose the customer that has made the payment. A list of invoices issued to the customer will appear. Four select the account where payment will be deposited to. Five enter the details, payment date, payment type, payment details, and check number if necessary. 6. Enter the amount received from customer slash payee. 7. Users may choose to receive payment from multiple invoices at the same time. The system will auto-deduct the amount that has been paid from the amount due accordingly. 8. Office Expert allows partial payment where the system will mark the invoice as open with partial payment. 9. The system will auto-generated receipt for payment that has been received. Thank you for watching Office Experts tutorial video.